next malfunction drill up is the stove pipe, otherwise known as fair to eject. All right, so here I've got the classic stove pipe set up right here. Empty case, vertically sticking out of the chamber, but pinched by the rear of the barrel hood. All right, just like that. Now, I'm gonna take you through how you clear it. So it comes up on target, boom, and now you see this in your sight picture. Really simple, finger straight muzzle wear, you're gonna come up knife edge and you're gonna sweep it off. You're back on target, bang, all right? Now, let me show you another version of a stove pipe that you need to be aware of. This is called the inline stove pipe, all right? You, you will see this on occasion. So now I take and put the empty cartridge case like that, all right? This is what we call, once again, the inline stove pipe. So I don't see this in my sight picture like the one standing up. Now I come up and go, oh, whoa, we got a problem. Here's the problem. If you try the sweep, it's not going to work, but it will be a nice DNA sampler. All right, it's going to cut you. So what you want to do is, what I teach is a plan A, tap, rack, bang. All right, especially if you slightly modify it. Right, tap, and then I come over the top, rack and hesitate and let the slide come back on target, boom. That works like a champ for that inline stove pipe. So remember, classic stove pipe, Birkin pointing straight up, sweep it off. Inline stove pipe, tap, rack, hesitate, back on target, bang. Practice them, practice them at home with dummy rounds, no problem. You don't necessarily have to be out on the range and do it with live ammo. Have a good one.